Hello Leo and welcome back to my channel Lumen Moon Tarot. So Leo, I am here doing um, your March reading, right? Just taking a sneak peek into March, seeing what's going on around you and your energy. Um, this reading is for the collective, so it may or may not resonate with you, okay? Just take what does resonate and toss out the rest. And thank you so, so much, Leo, for your likes, subscribes, comments, shares, donations, everything that you guys do that helps this channel keep growing. Thank you so, so much. Okay. Leo. Divine, what do you have for Leo for March? What do we got? The sun. Coming to the edge. Okay, what I'm, Leo, what I'm feeling like here is that um, in March, you know, the sun's going to be out. You're going to want to get out and about, okay? But yet, at the same time, you're still kind of thinking about this never-ending story. Like, you're outside, you have fun, then maybe you come home and you're sad, or you feel isolated, you feel alone, you don't want to really look at this anymore. You know what I mean? Um... I feel like you still have some healing to do, Leo, and I feel like getting outside, getting grounded, um, if you're happy out here, because it looks like you are, it looks like you put, you're, you know, you're um, out in the sunlight, you could be dealing with the Pisces, actually, because I'm seeing this fish here, and I feel like the divine is, is trying to say that, um, you know, maybe, maybe you need to speak your truth about something when you're away from home it seems like you're a lot happier I don't know what this is because it's almost like at home you feel sad you feel isolated you feel like alone and it's just a never-ending story wherever you are you this is how you feel but outside out and about it's like you want to get out of some place okay and I feel like with Gabriel here, Archangel Gabriel, he's telling you to, you may have to open up that heart chakra and say something. Say something. There's something about when you're in solitude, too, um, undistracted. Your thoughts keep going back to the same thing. And I, I feel like in order to complete this cycle and start something new here with Come to the Edge, You've got to speak up. You've got to speak your mind. You know, be honest, right, about how you feel. I feel like you you just are ready to take a leap of faith here and go in a new direction here, Leo. You may want to even move here with the world card and come to the edge. You may even be thinking about moving because wherever you are, um, I feel like it just feels like such a never-ending story. I feel like you may be ready to um, have some kind of new environment around you, something happier. I feel like maybe that's what you're thinking about with the sun card here. Yeah, let's see what you've got going on. I don't know. I, maybe you're just, when you're alone and undistracted, your thoughts keep going back to the same thing. Maybe it's because you need to say something. Maybe it's because um, maybe it's because you need to speak up. I don't know. But I, I do see that the world with the world here, you're starting a new cycle. A cycle is ending and a new cycle is beginning. All right, what can you show me here for Leo for March? I hope this is making sense to you, Leo. You may need to speak your truth about something. Um, clarify this never-ending story. What's going on here? Clarify this never-ending story. Thank you. Yeah, just a lot of being deep in thought here about this. You could be dealing with a Virgo. This is a lot of cards. What's going on here? A lot of struggles you've been through. 
this is like too many cards but this king of swords i feel like i feel like this is having to choose your words wisely okay think about what you're going to say um i feel like you need you feel the need to speak up about something here because it's really bothering you it's heavy on your mind but with the king of swords and king of swords energy you really want to talk it's almost like you're preparing to speak up um, but you're choosing your words carefully here. A lot of strategic communication. Um, I just feel like you want to get out of a situation and start something new somewhere else. That's the feeling that I'm getting here. Nine of Swords. Um, can't sleep at night. You're up worried about it. I mean, this is causing a lot of worry for you, Leo. Yeah, you want to take a new you want to you want to take a leap of faith here and start something new. We've got to, I'm seeing both of these as the fool card. Right? This come to the edge to me is like the fool card. So yeah, you just want to start your um you want to start a new page in your life just really bad. Okay, well, but you're really super stressed out about it, or somebody is needing to speak up here. Speak your truth. Just choose your words wisely, you know. Um, be careful about what you're going to say. Maybe that's what you're trying to do here is thinking about how you're going to speak your truth. Um, a decision that you have to make, maybe. This could be to your twin flame, too. You could be having to communicate with somebody that um, I feel like you're elevating here and leaving somebody behind. That's what I'm feeling like. You may be stressed out about that, too, the things that you need to leave behind. You know, as this person comes to the edge, she's like blowing those hearts away like, I, got, I have to go now. I feel like it's got you really, really stressed out here. I hope this is making sense to you guys. Yeah, you want a new beginning. You want a new beginning. It's like you're breaking free, but it's like you're really anxious and stressed out about that. Uh, doing a lot of thinking. Okay, what more can you show me here? Because... I feel like maybe um, maybe you want to move or go to a different location. A cycle needs to end, and maybe you're scared. Maybe you're, I don't know. It's like night after night you worry about this. Having to communicate your truth, maybe who it's going to hurt. Because, you know, the Knight of Swords comes in quickly to talk, but... And it's the truth, but they, they're they not as controlled as the King of Swords, right? What they what they say is going to hurt. Um, yeah, there may be a moment where you just kind of um, speak your truth really quickly. You may, it could be in a moment of anger and um, you just take a risk and you blurt it out. It's something very impulsive. This could happen in March. Uh, now this is either you or your person, but a truth needs to be spoken here. I feel like somebody from your past is going to feel betrayed. Somebody who loves you is going to feel very hurt. So, you know, choose your words wisely in March, right? Um, I don't think you want to hurt anybody. That's just it. This wants to come out. It could be about money. Um, like you could be talking to this King of Pentacles. I'm seeing this as this could be you. These could be parents as well. Okay, take it how it resonates. Yeah, it could be about money, finances, or a commitment. 
somebody's speaking the truth like in an impulsive moment here regarding um, either money or a commitment. I kind of feel like I don't know what it is. You know, you guys could have kids together. This could be a kid coming towards you and saying, you know, I want to start a new life, but I feel like they get they get upset. They do it in like a spur of the moment kind of thing. All right, what else can you show me? It could be a very painful time in March. I don't know what this is all about. I hope this is making sense, Leo. All right, what else can you show me? Yeah, it's almost like you're worried about confronting this or somebody's worried about confronting this. Take it however it resonates with you. I feel like somebody here is very worried about confronting having to speak their truth. Um, someone here is having sleepless nights over it, you know. It's just a never-ending kind of story. They want to be out. They want to start something new. They want to start a new cycle here because an old cycle is coming to an end. Um, yeah, and somebody's afraid of confronting this, so maybe they do it like at the drop of a hat, right? Um, like an impulsive moment or a moment of anger or something, and it, it hurts somebody else. Could be parents, could be, this could be you, somebody that you're committed to. Clarify this Ten of Pentacles. It could be about money. It could be about a commitment. Take it however it resonates. High Priestess. There could be some kind of secret too, but that's not really what I'm feeling like. I'm feeling like somebody's just going to be intuitive and quiet about it. Someone's going to just be very quiet, intuitive, Standing in their strength, standing in their integrity. I mean, I feel like this is you here, Leo. All right? Handling things with grace as much as you can. And just venturing out. I feel like it's time for you to start something new here. You're, you're handling this with grace and using your intuition and going on a new journey. You're, you're standing your ground in what you want and... And you're letting people know. Yeah. You're letting people know. It's, it's a judgment. This is what you want. You want to start something new. You want to get out, right? Yeah. There, it could cause some fights, some competitions. But you're, you're wanting to make a move. I feel like you're going to calmer waters here. You're putting burdens down, right? And no more sleepless nights, right? All of these swords that you think about in the middle of the night, you're putting them in a boat and you're taking off. You're, you're starting something new for yourself. This could be traveling. This could be a move. But you're starting something new for yourself. That's what you want. And I feel like you're communicating this in March to possibly two people who... I don't know. I feel like you're standing up for yourself here. I honestly, I don't see a whole lot of fighting. So maybe there's some there's some fighting in the background with between between friends or something. I don't know. But I see you I see you um starting a whole new cycle in March. It's going to be a it's going to be a very exciting time for you. It's going to release you from all of the stress speaking your truth but try to do it properly right um but yeah you know what you want leo and you're using your intuition yeah anyway guys yeah i don't know i don't know who this is for <laughs> it's more of a life kind of thing i think but um, anyway, take it however it resonates with you. If you like this video, please click that like button. Subscribe to my channel. Help me grow. 
Um, yeah, and until next time, Leo, take care of you, right? Um, stay strong and peace out.